my name is Roderick Turner, and I'm an artist. And these are two of my pieces here, Still Life. And basically what I do is I set up my objects within my studio, and then I paint them. But they have to have a certain meaning to them. And in this one in particular here, we're dealing with spices, garlic, um, and there's a bottle of um, lemons, uh, I think it's um, olives. And then in the corner is a handmade pot holder. And so each object is very significant to me in some type of way, and I want to get the feeling of, uh, of the kitchen, of the kitchen flavor. And then here is the same way where I was, what I do is I continue to work this subject over and over and two, and, and two I, I feel I said what I need to say. And because they're paintings, the, they, uh, I can only explain them with so much because the, the rest is left for you to interpret visually. And the pot holder that you're looking at within the piece that I was talking about earlier, well, my mom, she made the pot holder. And so I wanted to incorporate it in the painting to, to show her work as well. This particular piece is, uh, is done oil on canvas, and it was done from photograph. I use photographs for reference, as well as I worked from sketches, from, um, as well as working from the live model. And this particular piece is uh, about uh, his, name, his name is Carlton, known as the Unknown Pianist. And in the background, what I did was, he, since he's also um, my piano teacher, that um, I showed some sheet music in the background and also the flute um, to, give, to bring out to his character that he is a musician. And so basically, um, that's what this piece is about. In Elizabeth Hospital. And this is oil on um, linen. And basically, this painting was done on site. And so, particular, this piece uh, caught my attention because when I saw, I knew this at the time. This area is ch the area was changing, and so since the area was changing, I wanted to capture this history because the, the buildings, the the uniqueness of the uh, of its architectural structure, I felt need to be preserved in some type of way, as well as at the same time, my studio, which you see this building here looks the same way, was adjacent to this particular um, painting. And I want to remember that site, because when I was working on my uh, commission for them, they end up letting me use part of their facility for um, my studio. And in doing that, I wanted to also remember a little bit about that. So I painted this particular piece using the, you know, in the, in the, using the technique of the Impressionists because I uh, haven't been to um, France, haven't been to Givigny, and studying Monet's works and stuff, and um, their approach. I wanted to, to, to at least kind of carry over some of that, being a lineage of, those, of American artists who went to France and who came back to the United States. And I want to continue to, to the tradition in painting in that style. And so this piece, once again, is um, the Saint, uh, Saint Elizabeth, old Saint Elizabeth, because now is, um, the landscape there is changing. The piece is called um, es Escapade, sure? and I painted on site with this particular um, piece here. And in this one, what caught my um, um, attention was basically the boats and the boat houses. Oh, that's the and, no, uh, and I like the way the, the scenery looks down there. And once again, because the area is changing, um, this, since the area is changing, I want to record that as well. Because sometimes what I find about my paintings that a lot of times there are a lot of subtle changes that happen within DC that go over, um, that people overlook. So therefore I like to capture that. And, in, and also, once again, using the same air of the, the line of the Impressionist, I, in my paintings, I deliberately exaggerate sometimes by pushing my like, background either further back by using uh, softer colors and, and emphasizing the light with the cool and the warm colors. So I deliberately will play around with certain things like that. So in, and so in this particular piece, here, I just want to re reflect that and try, to, I was hoping to, to, to at least cap capture the air of the, the, the wharf 
So I wanted to at least try to do that in this particular case. Thank you. Thank you.